First, we have to talk about Gareth Bale because we saw two amazing mm -hmm. goals and what a performance from the man who isn't really getting his starts. He has been linked with moves away from Real Madrid this summer. But what did you think of that performance? Is he saying, hey, coach, put me in, let me start for that Champions League final? Well, he's a confidence player. He got a great goal in the Classico last week. Two fabulous goals there, particularly the second. But it depends what way Zidane goes, if we're thinking about the final. If he goes with Benzema and Ronaldo up front, that's four in midfield. We know Casemiro, if fit, Modric, if fit, Chris, if fit, are going to play. And it leaves one slot, which is looking like it's probably going to be Isco. Lucas Vasquez has, has played in, in the wide positions. You've got Asensio as well. But if he does decide to drop Benzema and maybe play Ronaldo through the, through the middle on his own, it could leave maybe Isco playing off him and, and, and a position for Bale. That's the only way I can see Bale getting a game. I, I, I personally would like to see him play but I don't think Zidane will start him. Stevie, should he start? Listen, he could have scored all six of these goals today. <laughs> and no chance. And he's not, he's not starting. You know, you've but that's got such a waste of a, a wonderful talent. And this basically is but his reason about, to leave it's now. It's not about individuals. You know, Real Madrid have gotten to the final because of the way Zidane has set them out recently. And, and recently, in the Champions League, Gareth Bale just... He's not even... He hasn't even come off the bench half of the time. You know, he's been third off the bench be behind Asensio and, and behind Benzema when they haven't started. So if we think there's any chance that Bill starts this final, it's zero. Well, it's, Shaka, it's, it's, should he just leave then? Is this well, just glaringly obvious now? Obvious now? <laughs> well, not now, but of course. Well, now fight. at the end of the season, <laughs> how big of a waste of talent is this sitting there on the bench I, and not look, starting? I think Gareth Bale right now is, is a valuable impact player for Real Madrid, and no more. He won't start. You just can't see it. Maybe something changes in the game, and you need his pace just, just to maybe upset Liverpool or, or whatever it may be. But, but he's not a starter, and you don't see that changing anytime soon for, for Gareth Bale or, or for Real Madrid. So, yes, you can understand why he's welcoming the overtures from the likes of Bayern Munich, because I, I, I just don't see how he fits in from the start, given how well Real have been playing, particularly in the Champions League. It's not quite as simple, you know, as when you said, surely just leave. Well, you just, yeah. you just well, if don't he doesn't go, start well, in the final, then, if he doesn't start in the Champions League final, should he just leave? Take it upon himself to leave. I know there's other factors well, that have to come into where, play, where, but... Where does he go? But there, are, there are very few options for him. Bayern, Bayern Munich, who have been mentioned, they don't go and pay 100 million for a player. Mm. They just don't do that. Right, Manchester so United or somewhere Manchester, back in the Premier League. Do, I mean, does he really want to go and play for Mourinho? You know, we'll criticise the, the way that how they do not open up and go for it. But at least he would get a start. I, 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 think, I think he'll welcome interest from Bayern Munich. And, and as we were talking about earlier, Bayern Munich have ageing players out in the wide areas who have been fantastic in their careers, but you see that time coming to an end. Will Bayern really pay that 90 million no. or whatever it is Real paid, paid for, for no. Gareth Bale? I, I doubt, but you, you see wages. a need. I mean, you the wages. Need. Bayern don't pay the wages either. Mm -hmm. I mean, so for Real Madrid to get rid of Bale, they're going to have to lower the price and they're going to have to, they're going to, have to eat some of his wages as well. And that's if Bale wants to leave. We don't even know that he really wants to leave.